much for that. Now, at the same time, the Kenya Union of Post-Primary Education Teachers, KUPIT, now wants the Ministries of Education and Health to take full responsibility over the loss of lives at Mukumu Girls High School in Kakamega County. The union, through its Secretary General George Missouri, says it will seek legal redress against the two ministries following the death of a teacher who also served as a boarding mistress at the school. As our very own Emily Chabet reports, Ms. Sori says the union is offended by the unlawful ousting of the school's principal. With inconclusive findings over the mysterious disease that claimed the lives of three students and a teacher at Mukumu Girls, the Kenya Union of Post-Primary Education Teachers, Kupet, has now turned its guns on the health and education ministries. Kupet Secretary General Akelo Misori says the two ministries must take full responsibility for the four deaths. Our teacher, a member, has died because of the negligence of the Ministry of Education and the public of the Ministry of Health. So we are suing them in that order. And we are suing them on behalf of the families who may not have the voice to do the same. Kupet is also accusing the two ministries of negligence in regard to laying out proper infrastructure, saying the situation at Mukumu Girls was aggravated by overpopulation. Before using this, the sledgehammer on the victims of the ministry's dysfunction, Honorable Machogu must clean his office first and ensure that his quality assurance officers understand and are accountable for their work. The union is vowing to file a lawsuit over the forceful removal of the principal of the school, Frida Ndolo, and the dissolution of the board of management, saying Education CS Ezekiel Machogu's action served to undermine efforts to find a lasting solution to the problem. This is somebody whose professional career and reputable performance in public service and as a teacher for a long time has been ruined by a mistake of the public health and a mistake of the Ministry of Education. According to Missouri, Mukumu girls like other schools were meant to accommodate not more than 600 students, but currently the school has over 2,000 girls sharing the limited resources. A school of 2,028 is an equivalent of an overlocation in some jurisdictions in this country, or an equivalent of a sublocation, which has got two health centers. But in this school, if it ever has anything like a health facility, there is only somebody who is reporting sickness. The union is calling on CS Machogu to convene a multi-agency team to review compliance with the Kenya School Health Policy 2018, which provides guidelines on ensuring healthy environments in learning institutions. <laughs> Emily Chabet, Citizen TV, Nairobi. All right, Emily, thanks so much for that. Now, at the same time,